up, everyone? Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com, swagged out alongside. It's time for anal. No, 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 no. Oh. Back, wrong, not backside. Oh. It's time for back, not back. <laughs> totally different, my brother. Post workout anal, dude. Check it out. So we did a I high really rep. Lower back pressure. From what I heard <laughs> on the internet. I, I you read that on the internet? No, I wasn't reading it. It was something. It was like a. It was like a uh, blog. That was on the new TigerFitness.com blog. I like how you know what you are relaxed you face more. Stu told him to like not go crazy with the faces. But it's um, interesting, yeah, because the science we were talking about the science. Like when you sit there and you got the mad ass face and you're trying to do all this, it actually makes the exercise harder, right? So the the, the, the theory is let's like have a relaxed face. If you're watching a runner, watch an Olympic sprinter, right? Their faces are actually very very relaxed. Speaking, That's how you get the most output. Speaking of hard, look at my lats here. I had to put a shirt on over my tank top. Because the pad, my lats didn't fit in the pad, so I need to loop that bitch up. He was hurting. He, I was hurting. No, it's hurting. called having big lats. His lats, he actually was hit I mean, the side every it was, day. It was like, and literally my lats are a little bit scratched up right now. But it's okay. Nothing works unless you do. Those shirts are available at TigerFitness.com alongside the hat, the wristband, and the tank top. Is this an infomercial? Fuck yeah. I'm always trying to sell <laughs> shit, man. We got to fund this channel. This is actually good. Though. I, actually, I, I can imagine a lot of you have done this, but this is actually one of my favorite exercises. I love the pullover. You see people in the gym. I think we might have to do a teaser. We might have another stupid shit coming stupid out. Shit another was, stupid shit coming out. like 300 something thousand views, 330, man. I think it's like a third of a million. So we may have to reprise it. There's some cool shit coming. But the real the idea here is really getting that full range of motion. I think you see people barely bring it about a quarter range of motion. I think you feel that nice stretch. The Speaking key to this stretch, exercise is not to hit yourself in the nuts. And if you're a girl, I hear that it hurts even when you hit yourself in the vagina. Interesting. Is that another internet rumor? No, 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 no. I know a lot about vaginas. Look at the and video I, work. The video work is on point. You, yeah, you, you know your face is. I mean, the thing is, when he used to pose, it was oh, the funniest it was shit. The first year. Like, I'd be like, your, your posing's great, but you really need to work on no, your face. It was epic faces. It I've was better. It was. It was epic. It, it actually was, is something you got to work on, though. And I think it, you can tell the difference that when you relax your face, your upper body, you actually can focus on that workout. That that works out a lot more. This Look at that. So talk about the the, the uh, rows here. Only one plate. Let's give them something to talk about. One plate because well, my back snapped up yesterday. Stu, it's a SI joint down in the bottom. Bottom. We released it. I'm able to get full function on my hamstring, but at the end of the day, I'm fucked up, y'all. Yeah. I'm messed up. But the point is here, like we've done. By the time we're done here, it's 22 sets of back, right? We just did the 420 set, or 420 rep blast on uh, we went Saturday. Heavier today, though. right? So we went heavier, but we did 22 sets, nice and good form, nice and controlled. Even on deads here, what Look we did a, a plate and a quarter. Look at that. Just form. focused on form, and Look we're going that. up a quarter of a plate every time. And this was still hurting my back, but I'm doing wall deadlifts where you stand about four inches from the wall, and you literally try not to hit your head against the wall. So I'm really working on my form and my posture, and basically what happened is all my muscles around my core got so big that it took away my core. So essentially, I'm having some imbalance issues, mental imbalances too. Right. So, I mean, we're, we're really working on that, the neurological function, getting it fired correctly, and uh, I'll be good as new. I'll be better than new. Speaking of better than new, you're, I mean, since your surgery, I think you're going to come out better. Yeah, no, in many ways I am. I mean, I, again, I had surgery three months ago, is deadlifting a plate and a quarter. Not that it was hard, the knee didn't bother me at all, but just almost like, it's, I would say this is as much mental as it is anything else, just sort of feeling it. My form's marginal, but it's getting there, it's getting better every time. And you can tell, I'm a little bit you know, nervous in my head to get a little lower in the stance there, but I'll get there. Yeah, and, and keep in mind, he just had his ACL prepared. Yeah, it's only I mean, been 13 weeks. Was it, it was a full reconstruction, oh, right? The ACL was gone, meniscus was cleaned up, Cartilage was cleaned up. It was a five-hour surgery. You were there. I was there with uh, with a bad skin disorder at the moment. It was the worst day of my life, I think. Um, aside from that one I night I spent in prison, there. but I enjoyed that. So this is where we finished. I mean, we've already, as you've seen, we've done a ton of stuff. Fairly heavy early on. We did up to between three and five sets of each. Right. So, so now I'm we're just sort of fishing out here, right? We're yeah, we did out. two sets of these and two sets of close grip. And then we finished up with one set of low rows, as you're going to see. I mean, we're, we're really pounding the volume, but we're still getting heavy weights, still overloading the muscle. And uh, really just bringing our physiques and our performance to the next level. Last night I did Muay Thai. Um, Aaron said, whoa, nice finger. You're finger banging my camera. <laughs> oh, no, watch, watch, watch what happens here. This is why I was getting my fingers in position for the extreme close up. And that, then I started to pan back. See, that's what the, the finger is just all positioning. I was oh, finger banging it. Finger banging. Your, your camera liked it and it knows it. Finishing it up, we got Thanksgiving tomorrow, guys. Thanks for watching. Click, like, subscribe, share, and all that shit.
It's, it's, it's a family day. It's a friend day. You know, your friends are your family in this world. Like, we're all so close together. Like, whether you're blood or you're not, you're still family. You know, we love you all. But, you know, speaking of blood, it's time to masturbate. Anything you got to say? No, nope, I'm telling you, it's turkey time. And when is turkey time? You know, it's not a game. <laughs>